So it's my turn, I try to be brief. Okay, it's uh, a presentation about uh, MPPolNet, which is one of the newest um, tools that uh, Metafor, Metafor, Metagotum in Spanish, is developing uh, together with us. I'm working at the uh, Universidad Carlos III de Madrid, but uh, I don't know, I spend one day a week in Metafor, in Meta, in Meta Cuatro, so I'm half here, half there. Okay, two hands. Okay, two hands, always. So the uh, agenda of the presentation will be like that. First, uh, we will chat a little about Metafor as a company. Second, we will uh, underline the one of the phenomena that we are facing right now is the battle of the decade between HTML, HTML5 and uh, apps, native apps. The third is the uh, scenario of the intellectual, uh, human and intellectual capital management systems. And uh, later we will chat a little about the project. And finally, we will wrap up with some conclusions. OK. So Metafor, I don't know if you are familiar with that. But most of our payrolls in universities are paid using this system. So it's something <laughs> that is quite important for us. Yeah, e even if, if the, if the pay. okay, okay, even if the, if the money we we are getting is really, really, really small, okay, it's still worth to to, to note. Okay. So um, last year, uh, this company has a revenue of this kind of uh, million euros, uh, 56 uh, million euros, which is not bad. Uh, and it's growing a little, it's growing a little, which is something uh, remarkable here in Spain, okay? They are present, and, and that's why they are present in, in, in several countries, because in Spain, uh, let's say that we are going like that, we are declining, okay? And uh, they are managing more than uh, 18 million employees around the world, and uh, a little more than uh, a thousand clients worldwide, mostly focused on Latin America, Spain, Portugal, and France. And they are trying to, to, to conquer a little USA market and other markets like, I don't know, uh, Germany, China, India, they are doing their best. I, I don't know if they succeed or not. Okay. The good stuff is that they are changing their model, their model from an on-premise, which is a software product that you buy and you install it, okay, to a software as a service a mode. And we've been in this in this change. I mean that uh, I've been working there I don't know since 2007, 2006, so it's seven, six years. And we have seen this transition from uh, on-premise software you, you buy and you install on your own to software as a service. And um, they have increased their revenue in this new model by 52% last year. So it's important. They are not telling in how much, uh, in, in what extent they are they be reducing the, the traditional model. But okay, in the other, they are going like that. Okay, and, uh, and now it's 21% of the revenue of the group, which is quite remar remarkable. Ah, and of course, it's one of the two main companies in Spain that are in Truffle 100, and also it's a, best, um, a place, a best place to work and whatever. And they are investing, they are telling that they are investing 20% of their revenue annually in research and development activities, okay? What is called, let's say. Good. So, uh, the first project that we approached is it was, uh, I don't know, six years ago, was the transition to the, to the new model. The second, the, the transition of the, of the, the presentation of the, of the, of the um, to, to a new model. And now, after a project in which we um, changed the focus, I mean, finally, the focus of the, of the tool from on-premise to cloud, now we are facing a project to, uh, let's say, launch the cloud, the mobile cloud market, okay? So that's why we're facing a, a, the, what is called the battle of the decade, because the, the first thing you got to decide is, okay, are we going to, to produce some apps or not? Okay, I've been in this, in this business for around 20 years, and I've seen these battles way back. I don't know, Novel, Microsoft, uh, uh, Oracle, uh, Microsoft, uh, Sun, Microsoft, uh, Linux, whatever. So it, it happens. 
Okay, and now the, the let's say the buzzword is the battle of the decade. Okay, are we going to uh, in a standard way using HTML5 or not? Are we going to uh, use native apps? Okay. So the the name of of, the, of that battle of the decade was uh, named by Mikonen and Taibal Sali two years ago, and now I think that this this kind of battle is is, is uh, here to stay because uh, people really want three things. The first one is rich media, rich applications, something catchy, okay? Location-based services, okay? The integration of where you are to what you are doing or what you want, okay? And finally, social integration. This is something that is more or less easy to do if you have an app, but is a little bit more complicated if you have a, a, a HTML file. And two questions. The first, Okay, they are telling that the web is the platform, but are we sure about that? I'm not sure, because if I have an, an app here, this is an, an Android, okay? Uh, and you have, I don't know, who have? You. You have, no. Who have an, an Apple? You have. Okay? And you have that? Okay, I need to compile from here to that. So, it's not true. The web is not the platform. The mobile is the platform in this case. Okay, so the, this, the operation system is the platform. And the other is buy one, buy it once. If I buy an application, can I run it everywhere? No. I need to, to buy two. If I'm going into an application, if I'm going to an HTML5, no. Okay, so this is the first, let's say, big decision, hard decision that they need to win it, to uh, face. Okay. The second is the scenario of, 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 the, of this kind of application that we have. Okay, we are facing not educational, uh, I mean, higher education <coughs> scenario. We are facing a scenario of uh, organizations trying to do the talent man management. Okay, so maybe it's even more broader that we, that we are, let's say, more um, uh, used to. Okay, so uh, let's go to the, to the big names. Okay, Garner. Garner says that mobile and social support within talent management suites is in its infancy. So almost nobody, and it's, it's a report from March 2013, okay? Uh, Garner, Garner is telling us, okay, we got a lot of suites, but a a, 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 let's say, like that of support in mobile, okay? Many vendors can now demo mobile offerings, but large scale deployments are still hard to find. So we have a demo, maybe, okay, but not that full application uh, devoted to, 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 to run in mobile applications. So there is a niche. Let's try to find it. Okay, so a little, you know, I've, I've worked in, in, in consultancy, so you know, it's my trend, okay? <laughs> in Spanish, la, la cabra siempre tira al monte, okay? Okay, so this is my trend, okay? So this is the, the the road goes to the mountain. Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. Okay. So uh, this is this is the, the magic quadrant of this kind of solutions. Okay. And we see here the leaders of the market. Okay. We have SAP, of course, we know. Cornstorm on demand, not very, I'm not sure you are into that. Oracle. Okay, so we got the two big names here. And where is Meta 4? It's here. Okay, so they are niche flyers. But they are trying to move from niche flyers to visionaries. Why? Because they want to be really, really, really mobile. And mobile and <coughs> cloud mobile, not only mobile. Just cloud and mobile together. Okay, so they are trying to go in this direction. Okay, some of them have, some of these um, um, suites have, let's say, some uh, decent uh, cloud uh, stuff, but partial, okay? Metaphor in this sense is trying to convert the whole model. Well, not the whole, 80%, which is not bad. Okay? So, the project. What is the project? Okay? The project aims at creating a technological infrastructure for human intelli and intellectual capital management in a mobile cloud environment. Okay? And we will do it in two years. Okay? We started uh, last May and we will end in the April 2015. Okay, and but we are not doing on our own. Okay, we got some 
decent funding, not very decent, but okay, some small funding from CTI, which is the Spanish Chamber of uh, Innovation or whatever, okay, under the project called Gestión de Capital Humano Intelectual Basado in Cloud Computing para un Entorno Mobile. So it's like the translation of that into Spanish, okay? And what we have right now, some demo, okay? We have sold this demo, I don't know, a month ago? Yeah, but <laughs> good. So we are trying to do like a sprint of, of a scrum, okay? And we saw the demo to one of the main uh, customers of Metafor in Spain, uh, which is some um, company uh, devoted to pro produce clouds, clothes, okay? You know, you know who, which company is that, okay? So important company, okay? So uh, what was the, the feedback? Okay, we want it because this Features here, I mean here, of location-based services is something interesting for them. Why? Because you can do something and automatically using your location. Maybe you are in a store. Maybe you are in another, uh, let's say, building doing something. So it's something that for them is catchy and is worth. Okay. So conclusions. I'm trying to be brief. It's a big project and I'm trying to be brief, okay? So as a service and mobile cloud solution continue to grow. And I'm not telling so, it's in the paper. So, uh, and Gra uh, Garner is telling so and also Forrest, okay? According to Garner, mobile cloud computing will reach a market value of this amount of billion, uh, I mean, it's uh, American billions, okay? Next year, not bad, not bad. However, despite the hype achieved by mobile cloud computing, the growth of mobile computing subscripts is still below expectations. But we are doing our best, okay? Because in talent management, is something that really makes sense to have this kind of cloud applications devoted to corporations, not only for students, I mean, in, in higher education institutions, okay? And what software industry must do is to push in that direction. And this is one of the, uh, let's say, examples of that. Okay, I'm not sure how many minutes have been run. Good. So, thank you.